November is the Great American Smokeout Month. It's our mission today to reach as many of you as possible with the message, tobacco kills. Within 10 to 20 minutes of your last cigarette, what you'll see happen, your heart's beating fast, your blood pressure's elevated with all those cigarettes. Within 20 minutes, your heart rate will slow, your blood pressure will be lower. Other things are happening as well. Carbon monoxide levels within 12 hours will normalize. Those sinister looking molecules prevent oxygen delivery to vital tissues. That's 12 hours. But beyond that, within a month or so, blood flow to these little sacs, these alveoli improves, so lung function improves within a month. At the same time, the little hair cells, you're, you don't lose your heart, but the little hair cells that line your airways, they begin working again. They sweep away all of that debris. So boy, coughing, shortness of breath, it's improving and you're a month or two out. Your risk of heart attack, heart disease, is half of that of a smoker within a year of quitting. But that's not all. Your brain, stroke. I'll tell you right now, smoking is one of the worst things you can do. It increases your risk of stroke, but within five years of quitting, your risk of stroke is that of a non-smoker. And let's talk about cancer. We have to talk about cancer. Within 10 years, your risk of lung cancer has been decreased in half, as has your risk for oral, throat, bladder, as well as cervical cancer, even your pancreas. And so the take-home message for anyone at home and Tammy for you, it's never too late. And the earlier you quit smoking, the more years you have to enjoy with your beautiful daughters, with your grandchildren who are soon to be born.